Hey guys, hope you're having a great day. It was a great laugh back doing some Jethro Toll. Dude, you know, after you showed us the first one, we had to do another one. Obviously. Dude, way too good. Breath was, it was too, way too good. good. Too and good. so, by far, this is like the one of the comments where everybody was like, Aqualong. Do Aqualong. Yep. So That's t time to give back to that request. Uh, yeah, but oh, before we start, make sure you hit that subscribe bell, notification bell. Stay up to date with everything that we do here. Cause, 100%. Damn, we're going to be hitting some more bangers. Let's dive into it.
start away on easy. You pour out sod, you see it's only me. Sad, dude. There was no flute, yeah, was and for thing. some reason, I was like, expecting I guess expecting it. flute, and so it didn't yeah. happen. I kept going, like, when's it coming? And then it yeah. kept not coming, and I was sad. Yeah, I didn't realize at the end. I was like, dang, we're at the end, and there's no flute. Um, so first thing, I think it was a good song, but I think this song um needs about eleven listens before we can really like super enjoy it. I feel like, at least for me, so here, I feel like it'll grow on me. So here's my thought. Um, at first, first few lyrics, I was like, well, it's kind of uncomfortable lyrics. Like, it felt felt very rapey. I think that's the vibe they were going for with some, some homeless guy or some like, yeah, sound like a homeless guy basically at a Maybe. park trying to like kidnap kids, which, yeah. which made sense to me. One of the other things I didn't love was the chord progression in the beginning and the end. I loved the da 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 was a really cool melodic line, but the chords that they followed after it just, I get they were trying to be jazzy and weird, but it just felt like it was pushing the envelope of something that wasn't like of just let me be weird to be weird and not really this isn't yeah. quite enjoyable yet right other than that i thought when it got into the light guitar work there's a more modern song some of you maybe know it uh it's by the gorillas what's the one uh by the windmill i don't know dang it's like the biggest gorilla song let me find it yeah yeah very similar right? okay so it's uh feel good ink by the gorillas it's it's definitely a more modern song so i don't know if you guys know it i think it's very reminiscent of like they definitely listened to this song and you they think did so that. Uh, yeah it, i it, love i did love the fucking acoustic part in this song. it felt so cool and the vocal effect on it where it felt like it was tucked in the back Just, oh yeah the, the whole atmosphere of that section was phenomenal so so my thing so like the the, the very beginning and the very yeah. end <laughs> I'll, i'm gonna give that those sections at least right now for me like a 7.5 okay for those sections but the the middle like eighty percent, like like when it, like it started with that main transition where the like vocals got tucked back and the acoustic. I think it was like a nine point like three from then on for me. Okay. But that's like the middle section, then the outskirts are like a little bit. But I think they, they could grow on me if I read the lyrics or maybe, maybe like understand like what they're, what going, they're going for. for. Okay. Um. But yeah. Yeah, I think for me, um, eight point three, eight point three. Yeah. Overall. It is wasn't as good as locomotive breath. At least, like for like for me. No, but this is also more artistic. This seems like one That's that is, is a little harder to love. But it's yeah, maybe I think just it's an acquired beautiful. acquired taste. Yeah, because we did get a lot of suggestions for it. So, like I said, on the eleventh listen. So at some point in the next couple months, I'm like for maybe like the next like Jethro Tull video. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, yeah. all right, guys, we're twelve listens in. Here's how I feel about the video. Maybe we'll do that. Do you an update. I mean? <laughs> uh, we also might do uh, if you guys want it. We'll do maybe a lyric analysis of this song. So we break it down. If that's something you guys want, let us know in the comments. A separate video we'll do just us breaking yep. down the lyrics. Maybe it'll make us love it more. Yep. That being said, let us know your thoughts. And, and what's uh, the next Jethro Tull song we got to do? Oh, yeah, definitely I mean, for we sure. We'll see you guys there. Catch ya. You feel the love. 